is found in about 50% of food products in Aussie supermarkets. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, it's hard to know because the oil is rarely labelled. Now, palm oil plantations are the leading cause of deforestation in Indonesia and Malaysia. They're pushing Borneo's orangutans dangerously close to extinction. Well, a new bill has just been passed in the Senate which calls for the mandatory labelling of palm oil on all food and grocery products. Louise Grossfeld from the Borneo Orangutan Survival Foundation joins us now with more. Louise, good morning to you. Now, there are reports that more than 80% of the orangutan's habitat has been lost and the species could be extinct within uh, the wild within 20 years. Staggering stats, are they right? Good morning to you both. Yes, it's like so many species that um, are facing an uncertain future. Um, orangutans are certainly one of them. You know, human population growth, um, economic instability, deforestation and um, palm oil are all these factors that contribute to an uncertain future and unfortunately yes the orangutan is facing that particular situation as well. Okay so will labelling palm oil on these, in these products really make a difference to the situation? I think the greatest thing about the bill being passed with the Senate is the fact that it gives the power back to the consumer to make an informed decision and um, what we're really aiming towards is a sustainable future. Um, palm oil is a part of our world, it is found in many of our everyday products and we want people to be able to feel like they can make an informed decision. So yes, I do believe that clear labelling will help us to achieve this. What exactly is palm oil found in? Pretty much in everything. You wouldn't expect it, but detergents, shampoos, chocolate, washing powder. So it's very much a part of our day-to-day -day living. So it's here with us. So, so what's your message? It, people should have, now that these products are labelled, I guess you're asking for people to avoid those products, but, but what do you do? I mean, if, if, if palm oil is in so many products? It's about people making a informed decision and the labelling will enable people to do that. We want to encourage, I guess, a sustainable future and there are options for sustainable palm oil out there. So labelling will allow people to make that decision. And the other thing I'd like to say for those people that are really interested and want to be involved, feel free to log on to the Borneo and Orangutan Survival website, www.orangutan.com.au. And we have a lot of information there. We also talk about orangutans, if you're particularly interested in that, and how you can contribute. And um, we're also very proud to announce that we have a fundraising event coming up this Wednesday, which actually is supporting our rehabilitation and release program. We're hoping that while we still have the palm oil issue to deal with, that we are able to release some of the animals in our sanctuary. We were able to secure 100,000 land area of land recently and we're hoping that this uh, fundraising event will enable us to contribute to that.